So here are just some examples of how the business sectors and their environments can be assessed. So example one, this is a business in the primary sector. So read the scenario below and answer the questions that follow. Duke Mines DM. And they specialize in the extraction of platinum and their suppliers of mining equipment have increased their prices by more than 20%, which is crazy. And the supervisor does not have a good working relationship with the employees as well. Another issue and Duke Mines DM can no longer export their products due to an increase in the exchange rate. So the RAND is a lot weaker now. And you need to identify the business sector in which Duca Mines operate and motivate your answer by quoting from the scenario. So first things first, Duca Mines, they're in mining, dealing with natural resources. So for sure that is going to be the primary sector because the business specializes in the extraction of mines. Okay, so they're right at the top, extracting natural resources. Next, you need to quote challenges from the scenario above and classify each challenge according to the business environment and also state the extent of control that DM has over each business environment. So just to use a different highlighter now, their suppliers of mining equipment have increased their prices by more than 20% that came up here. That's a huge supplier issue. That is part of now the market environment. We can't control everything about the suppliers. We have partial control, just a little bit. So that forms part of the market because, well, they operate in the market. Our competitors can also buy from these suppliers. Next, the supervisor does not have a good working relationship with his employees. That's another major issue here. That's our supervisor. We can control that. We could mend relations. We could get a mediator in. We could fire the supervisor. We could get more employees. So we've got full control of the situation. And finally, DM can no longer export their products due to an increase in the exchange rate. Well, that has to do with the government making poor decisions. Maybe it has to do with the finance minister placing embargoes on different country, um, on different countries, like a trade ban. So we've got no control over that. That has to do with the government.